ladies that are out there today, huh? I hope y'all tuning in because we got something to do today. Welcome back to Eddie B TV. I am, of course, Eddie B. Nice to see y'all. And we are back at you again today for another reaction video. And uh, here on this uh, um, another installment of the uh, Women's Wednesday of Stand Up Comedy, we're going to get into someone that I have not gotten to before. And uh, hopefully it's going to be a good time. We're going to get into some Aiko Tanaka today. Okay. Well, have not um, heard of this woman ever. Um, just uh, scrolling through some things to uh, get to for uh, for today, and I saw her name and I saw the title, which I will say in a second is what made me want to get to it. But um, yeah, we're gonna get into some Aiko Tanaka today, and this one is going to be titled, "Oh boy, <laughs> we fucked the crap out of each other." Full set. <laughs> kind of full set we talking about here man i don't know man it might mean something else i don't know it's kind of spelled out a little bit strange here but uh, it don't matter man the the title of this one sounded goofy as hell and i want to see what she's talking about with this one so uh, yeah like i said i've never uh, heard of this woman before and uh hopefully uh, she's gonna make us laugh so let's go ahead and get into it like i said aiko tanaka with we fucked the crap out of each other <laughs> And if you like this reaction, please boom on the like button for me one time. Subscribe to the channel, ring that bell, and of course, leave a nice comment for your boy. Uh, constructive critiques, leave a nice suggestion or a request, and uh, throw a couple zingers at your boy. You know what I mean. Friendly dialogue, no drama here, okay? I cannot stress that enough. So, uh, yeah, man. Finally got back to work yesterday. You know, I'm feeling way uh, uh, much better than I have in a while. So, uh, yeah, hopefully I can keep riding that train, you know, because I want to feel good, you know? I don't want to feel sick anymore, man. It kills me, and I don't want to go through it no more. But yeah, hopefully these laughs will uh, keep us on that path. So let's go ahead and do it. Aiko Tanaka with We Fucked the Crap Out of Each Other. <laughs> right here on ADB TV, Women's Wednesday Stand Up, y'all. Let's get back to it. Oh, man. Titles, man. They're so awesome, aren't they? <laughs> hopefully they translate to a lot of laughs. All right, let's get situated with this one here. And here we go. I am from Japan. Oh. Shout out to me. I found out in this country, people are so affectionate. They like to hug, shake hand. In my country, we are not. So whenever we drop the ecstasy, we bow the crap out of each other. Oh, is that what? OK. Like this. Oh, hook it up, Aiko. Thank you. <laughs> that joke was A+. Plus. Uh -oh. I think it was. I'm Asian. I grade myself. <laughs> That's a good grade. <laughs> My name is Aiko. In Japanese, it means love child. Really? So I look up the dictionary. It says bastard. Damn. My last name is Tanaka. It means in the rice field. Oh, no. So my whole name means bastard in the rice field. Damn, that's cool. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. I love rice. Oh, I like rice, yes. I used to work at a Chinese restaurant for Jews. What? It's called Ching Ching. That's funny, man. That's funny. <laughs> that fits so perfectly, too. It's, uh, it's racist. Exactly. <laughs> we are known for this thing. It's called Chinese chicken salad. Sometimes, Jew lady walks in. She's like, can you not put chicken in it? No nuts. Dressing on the side. I'm like, why don't you eat at home? <laughs> Thank you for that. That's what I'm talking about, man. American guys are really weird. Every time they come up to me, they're like, Aiko, I want to take you out to eat sushi. That's strange. I never go up to a Swedish guy and say, let me take you to Ikea for some meatball. Assumptions, yes. No assumptions here. My ex was like, hey, I want to hear you speak Japanese. That turns me on. Oh. I'm like, why don't you go to Chinatown? <laughs> Yeah. You don't know the difference. <laughs> He's like, come on, I want to hear it. So I'm like, He's like, what did you say? I'm really turned on. 
I said, I'm with you, just for the green card. <laughs> Good one. Good woman, man. I, I like did this that. joke in all the Tina room. Everybody got quiet. <laughs> <laughs> I have a mother, and oh. I went to pick her up at the airport. Oh, and man. she had a shirt on, it says, bitch. <laughs> so I was oh, like, mom, man. do you know what does that mean? She's like, Aiko, it's a brand. <laughs> like Gucci. <laughs> 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 Your dad got it for me. Oh, there it is, there it is. Clever man. <laughs> I am a born again Christian. Uh, that means I used to be a slut. That's usually Jesus what it means. Jesus fixed me. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fix her, After please. After I become Christian, I become really lazy. Yeah. Every time my friend come up to me with issues, I said, "Let me pray for you." and I don't do anything. <laughs> That's what praying is, basically, yeah. I go to black church. It's like, I used to go to white church. It's really beautiful, quiet. I was falling asleep. Uh, black church, super animated and passionate. It's like a death jam. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I see that. I see that. I have an accent. People always come up to me, they're like, oh, it's so hard for you, you have an accent. I'm like, no, it's hard for you. <laughs> yeah, ex exactly. exactly. You gotta listen to my messed up English. <laughs> <laughs> I have a hard time saying the word Pedialyte. So I call it baby juice. <laughs> I was at the market and asked the guy, where can I find baby juice? He took me in the back. <laughs> oh, a happy ending, oh my God. You know oh. on the end of the letter you put P.S.? I thought it meant P.S. <laughs> <laughs> Dear sister, I hope you all want to see you soon. P.S. <laughs> you are adopted. <laughs> That's cold. Come on now. I just went to Vegas. I don't drink or gamble, so as a good Christian girl, only thing I enjoy is strippers. Yeah. Strippers are confusing, because this black girl came up to me, and she said her name is Asia. Oh, God. She was like, what's your name? I was like, Tyrone? <laughs> you guys are great, Jay and I. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh, that was good, man. Oh, I always enjoy, you know, race mixed in with good jokes. You know, it provides a little perspective that a lot of people just don't have, man. Oh my goodness. Oh man, Whew. this woman was funny, man. I very much enjoyed this one. All right. That was Aiko Tanaka, y'all, with the, uh, we, <laughs> she said bow, but it says in the title, we fucked the crap out of each other, I guess. Oh my goodness, man. You know what? It's funny, man, because she didn't, I, I figured she'd probably drop a little bit more profanity in this one, man, but I guess the title was a little bit on the deceiving end, but hey, it don't matter. It was still pretty damn funny. So, uh, yeah, man, it, you know what? Just like I said, I enjoy race mixed in with good humor, you know, because it, it, just like I said, it makes people realize things that they didn't know before, and maybe they can just go like, oh, what the hell was I thinking when that shit went down, you know? You know, I've, I've had that happen to me quite a few times before, too, you know? But um, when she started saying we bow the crap out of each other, I was just like, yeah, that's, that's cool, you know, but... I didn't know that's what happens when Japanese people get on ecstasy, man. I didn't realize that. But now you learn something new. <laughs> yeah, I'm just fucking with y'all. But, uh, <laughs> you know, I, I like how she uh, pointed out some things, you know, mixed in with that. You know, she was talking about, you know, I, um, 
I don't really dive into that so deep. You know, I've been with females before that had accents, but it wasn't really like the thing that was like, ooh and ah, you know, but if it is, it's not, it's not bad that someone feels that way. Maybe it's just a, a preferential thing, you know what I mean? Maybe that's just what it is, you know? Uh, me, I tend to get more turned on by actual skills in the bedroom, if you know what I mean. That's that's what turns me on, you know. Presentation, man, is, is very deceiving. You could look like you have it going on, but then all of a sudden it comes down to do the deed and next thing you know, crickets, man. Just nothing popping off, man. I can't stand that. It's very, very disappointing. But um, yeah, that happens for the ladies too, by the way, so I'm not gonna leave y'all out of the disappointment, man. So yeah. Um, what else did she talk about in here? About the accents, you know, um, she said, uh, say something, oh no, that's not the accent, that's something else. Say something in Japanese, and she was just like, I'm using you for the green card. That was a good line. Because I like when people like, you know, make fun of other people's, you know, things that, you know, get them all hot and bothered, you know? I mean, it, it, it's supposed to be something that makes everybody laugh, but I won't lie, some people would probably take offense to that and get all hurt in their feelings and all that, but man. Hey, that's something for them to work on, all right? Just try to keep it non-violent, all right? Because we don't need no more of that going down. But, uh, yeah, man, she's like, she's hella funny, man. I like how um, she also said that, yeah, about assumptions and stuff like that, you know? If you look at someone as Asian and then you just think, oh, yeah, we like to go out for Chinese food or, you know, for sushi or something like that, or she's Japanese, so obviously I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. But, yeah, don't ever assume that somebody wants something just because of who they are or how they look or something like that. That's very stupid. It's like when people look at me, you know, they don't know what the hell I like, so they're just like, uh, where you want to go eat, you know? So they find that confusion is kind of like your best friend in a situation like that you know but um it's like you see somebody black you know I mean you just think oh yeah you want to go out for some chicken you know I'd be like oh really did we go there yes I do want to go out for chicken but why would you say that <laughs> that's just awesome man I like her delivery you know and um yeah, she's pretty uh pretty sexy looking female if I may say so you know it's not like uh the most pivotal thing about her you know but you know she is very funny and uh she's got a good look to her as well you know just wanted to point that out but yeah, man, if you guys like Ico, you know what I mean? Give me some more sets from her, man, because um, even though the title is the thing that got me into this set, you know, it was a very deceiving title, but I did very much enjoy what she had to say, man. She's a very funny woman. And I'm going to go ahead and cut it off right there. One more time, uh, Ico Tanaka with, I'll just say this, we bow the crap out of each other just to end it because that's what she said. And if you like that reaction, please put them on the like button for me one more time. Subscribe to the channel, ring that bell, and of course, as always, leave a nice comment for your boy. Constructive critiques, leave a nice suggestion or a request. And uh, as always, throw a couple zingers at your boy. Friendly dialogue, no drama here, and that's exactly how I want to keep it. So yeah, this is going to be Eddie BTV signing off one more game here. Uh, back at it one more time, man. Obviously, everyone knows I was uh, out for a little over a week. And uh, missed uh, Women's Wednesday. I missed everything, you know, even the music Saturday and a random Sunday. But, yeah, we back at it, man. And uh, I was glad to get to this one, man. Uh, she's a very funny woman, man. I like how um, she um, uh, throws in those little zingers right there, you know, talking about the race stuff and talking about... I think the other funny one when she was talking about she uh, went to um, uh, like uh, strippers or whatever, but she's confused by them. I can't stand strippers, by the way. They make me sick. But <laughs> I like how she was just like... Uh, it's just like that one, um, uh, I don't like uh, different races that have other races' names. That's kind of weird to me. Like, there's some names, obviously, that are pretty neutral, you know, that anyone can really have. But sometimes when they take it too far, man, I just be thinking, like, what the hell are you thinking? I mean, of course, it's just a stripper name. I don't think that was her real name. But still, man, really? Asia? Come on now. That's just dumb as hell, man. Get your head out your ass. But, <laughs> but yeah, man, when she said Tyrone, man, I, that was hilarious right there, man. Just hilarious, man. It's just another example of how she could take some things like that and just make it funny. And uh, that's just awesome as hell. But uh, yeah, man, um, I had fun. Uh, I had fun getting to this one, and thank y'all for tuning in uh, one more time to it. Uh, like I said, if you got stuff from her that you like, man, drop them in the comments because I'd love to definitely get to another one from Ico one day. So yeah, until next reaction, love and appreciate y'all. Peace.